From the grad night deadline to the council of the year, we have got, got the, the scoop. scoop. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Centurions. I'm Cable Salante and I'm Bella Sergi and we're coming to you live from the Inside Scoop studio. Today is April 23rd 2018 and this time around I have Kate joining me because Leo is in Cancun visiting his relatives. Glad to be here Bella. Let's start off the broadcast with some announcements from Dr. Swanson. Take it away. Okay, good morning, Centurions. Today I have a special message for the juniors. To all 11th grade students at Century, this week we have SBAC testing. I know you're excited. The tests will be tomorrow, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Two of the days will be English testing, and the other two will be math testing. You might say to yourself, why would I try on a test like this? Well, I have a few reasons for you. First of all, the test will determine whether you receive the seal of biliteracy. We have quite a few seniors this year who will not receive the seal of biliteracy because they did not try as hard as they could have on the SBAC last, last year. Second, those of you who are considered English learners need to do well on this test so you can be reclassified. And finally, we want to improve what people think about Sentry, and one of the ways that we can do that is by doing well on tests like these. I have one more question for you, juniors. Do you think this test will be difficult? The answer is yes. This test is designed to be challenging. Even so, I want you to power through and give it your best shot. That's all that I can ask you for. Do your best. So when you feel like giving up, keep going. This is part of what makes Centurions unique, is that we keep going even when life throws us something difficult. The test starts tomorrow and goes through Friday. Nail it. Have a good day, everyone. Thank you, Dr. Swanson. Now on to some other important news. The deadline to purchase your grad night tickets is in two days. Tickets are on sale at the ASB window for $85, so now is the time to purchase yours. We are having our grad night at Universal Studios Hollywood which will only be open to our school and a couple others. Take a look at this video to see more about what that day will entail. Remember to purchase your ticket, seniors. For those of you that are participating in Paddapuff, they are having a mandatory practice today from 1.30 to 3. Again, it's 1.30 to 3. Last week, Mr. Menchaca and some of the staff went to congratulate and celebrate our Counselor of the Year. 
Take a look at this video. We are proud of you. Yes, we are proud of you. Hey, hey, hey. She was recognized by city council as an uh, exemplary counselor for the city of Santa Ana. Who was that? <laughs> Maria Vasquez. And today, again, that's why I mean it's like a home run because none of us in our district ever gotten any of these awards. And today at 11.30, she'll be schmoozing with the mayor, schmoozing with city council members. I must tell you, Brad Pitt will not be there. Brad Pitt will be somewhere else. But she will be receiving the Educator of the Year Award from the Santa Ana Chamber of Commerce. So give it away for Ms. Vasquez. I don't have lots to say. I'm just very appreciative of being recognized. I love what I do. I like giving back. Um, I just think I'm doing my job, and I'm glad that... Um, that you guys are recognizing it. We are a team, so I do it with my counseling team, my higher ed staff, all of our interns that support us. So it, it, this recognition is for uh, the entire team. And by AP Scott Michael. Yeah. Thank you very much. Congratulations, Ms. Vasquez. What a great way to start her weekend. Thank you for all of your hard work and dedication to Century High School and the students. We all appreciate and love you. We also have another amazing announcement. Congratulations to CHS senior Douglas Torres for earning a superior rating at the Southern California Band and Orchestra Association's Solo and Ensemble Regional Festival this past Saturday. Douglas earned the opportunity to participate in a regionals by receiving a superior rating earlier in the year at the festival hosted by Santa Ana High School. For both events, he performed the first movement of the Hummel Trumpet Concerto, a cornerstone of trumpet solo literature. Mr. Aguera mentions it was a pleasure to watch him tackle this piece over the course of the past year and develop it into a fine performance. If you see Douglas, please join me in congratulating him on this accomplishment and for his acceptance into the Bachelor of Music program at UC Santa Barbara. Listen up, prom tickets are still on sale at the ASB window for $80 with an ASB card at $95 without. Both juniors and seniors are able to go. You can take a date, ask a friend, or just go with your squad. Either way, it'll be an amazing night that you won't forget. Here we have a video of an announcement of our prom theme, Light Up the Night. I can't wait to see everyone dolled up at prom. Make sure to purchase those tickets at the ASB window. Hey Kate, you like reading, right? Yes, I do, and I kind of have to for my grade. Thanks to Mr. Kush. Well, luckily, book club will be meeting tomorrow during lunch. So if you want to develop on your reading skills, make sure to meet in Mrs. Rodebaugh's room on Tuesday. All right, Centurions, that's all we have for you on today's broadcast. But remember, together, together we, we can, can achieve, achieve more. more. Bye. Bye. <laughs>